I like how I can see the three things on the left, like very faintly. Oh, they disappeared. Never mind. Even though it was a loading screen, that was weird. You're back. That was fast. Actually, that trial took two years to get through. Hey, hey. So far. Right, all you other three, fuck off. It's mine. Is that what I think it is? It's the big daddy armor. Getting a closer look. Be careful. The javelin of General Tarsus. Something's wrong here. Or I guess big Ready, mummy. <laughs> I can barely hear you. Because it was a woman's hey, originally. But when I get in it, it will become hey, are you there? big. Uh oh. They can't hear you. Owen. Oh, oh dear. Javelin not working, huh? That's a shame. Owen. Click. What the hell are you doing? Don't come on, mates. Isn't it obvious? Oh, you mong. I mean, like, we were a bit of a dick to you, but not that much of a dick. Oh, gorgeous. You're not putting me on the sideline. If I side with a monitor, he'll leave the fort alone. How can you help the Dominion? You know what they've done. I know exactly what they've done. Beat them. Owen, stop! Damn it. Well, that was unexpected. Jesus. Huh. <laughs> okay, I'm liking it. Good. Good story turn, Bioware. You haven't lost your edge. <laughs> Jesus. Oh. Oh, easy money. 4.25 in the bank. No problems. Okay, now we can get out of here. <laughs> oh, hang on. An orange? Or... Wait, no, is that... No, it's not an orange. Damn it. I thought we just got the next tier or something. It's just a white and I'm stupid. Feels bad. God damn it. <laughs> well, uh, yeah, rip, I guess. Poor dude. Well, this is bad. Go ahead. Rip me a new one. <sighs> Could be better, yeah. Amplifier's glitching. I'm not sure what that son of a bitch did to the motor. Strider's frozen in place until we get it fixed. What about Faith? She all right? I'm analyzing the damage to the Strider's system. Hey, no talking until I get the connection fixed. Do you want to start a fire? So, we're stuck <clears throat> here while Owen gets away. I thought things couldn't get any worse. Ah, slow down, will you? 
Right now, you're in no shape to go chasing after him. Give me a hand with this, would you? We need to get the Strider moving. We need to do something to stop them. Flyers. See, that has always been your problem. You focus on what's up ahead instead of where you are. Where I am is in the middle of the mess I made. I brought Owen aboard, and look what happened. Tape. How do you think you did this by yourself? <laughs> the lone hero screws up again. <laughs> uh, give me the... Ah, uh, damn. Yeah. <clears throat> This is my Strider. Nobody bores without my say-so. Hell, Faye can read people like a book, and she didn't even see this one coming soon enough. Try the connection now. <laughs> You're a damn good freelancer. The best I've ever seen, maybe. But you're not smarter than me and Faye put together, and you don't have eyes in the back of your head. Quit jumping in front of bullets that ain't been fired. They have the javelin, so what? We watch while a monitor captures the cenotaph? I'm sorry, I got distracted. I should have caught the sabotage during my routine armor check. Enough guilt, you're both killing me. We got work to do. What work? It's over. No, not quite. The javelin they stole won't work. I got a good look at the general's armor. It's like no javelin I've ever seen. I can only speculate on what some of the systems did or might still do. Faye, just spill it already. I think most of the seals are key to the general's signet. And the Dominion can't run the suit properly without it. Slows them down, but does it help us any? Ugh. Slowing them down might be enough. I had the info we pulled from the Fortress of Dawn's library, and I got that up-close look at the javelin itself. Wait, Faye, are you suggesting we build our own javelin of Dawn? Not the whole javelin, just the relevant seals, but yes. Give you the plans, I can build it. <laughs> so you're Arden Vassa for us now. Why not? I've built whole javelins from scraps before. Now we're just gonna make a couple seals. Might have to jump over a few flaming chimeras first, but we'll get it done. <laughs> hey, flaming chimera jumping is chapter one of the Freelancer Handbook. <laughs> get your javelin ready. How many things? I got a drive to fix. Oh, chapter one. We're still in this race, people. <laughs> of the Freelancer Handbook. <laughs> I'm pretty sure that's like the fourth or fifth time he said, that's chapter one of the Freelancer Handbook. Okay, so... MacGuffin A does not work without MacGuffin B. So we have time to create our own MacGuffin A. <laughs> Great. Come on. So, so long as he's not about to tell me to go into free play and do a bunch of shit, we're cool. <laughs> Man, poor Owen, though. He's definitely not going to make it out of this. Find out what the project needs. Okay, who do I who do I got to talk to? Zoe, Tassin, Prospero, Lucky Jack, Faye, Halleck, <laughs> and Prindel Blatch. Is that the librarian? Quite possibly. Well... There are a few. Let's start. Actually, no, let's start with you. Hey, Zell. Keeping busy? You're not the only one that keeps me on my toes. Just your favorite? Of course. What's on the docket? Basic repairs? Always. Plus, I'm refurbishing the inner lining of Wright's Javelin. And Sentinel Hayden's getting extra lumber support whether he likes it or not. It's an easy ad. <laughs> the little things do indeed matter. Small comforts make a big difference. People underestimate that. Those comforts make life better out there, even if you don't notice it every day. I like to think that matters. Especially since my son told me he's going to be a freelancer. How old is he? Eleven. He'll want to be a dozen things before I have to worry. But I still worry. <laughs> ah, let's be encouraging. There are risks, sure, but there's nothing like being out there helping people, seeing the world, flying. It's not the worst dream for a kid to have. You're not wrong. The world's chaos. If he can dream about good things that could come out of it, why not let him? 
Tomorrow we'll want to be a Korok's teamer anyway. Besides, if he becomes a freelancer, you'll have his suit in top shape. That should give you some peace of mind. Not sure that works when you're the pilot's mother. It barely works with the rest of you. Because we're your favorites? Always. <laughs> Why can't I romance her? Come on, game. Come on, game. This Owen business is serious. Where is he? I don't know. That's what I thought you'd say. Then why ask? No harm in checking. After all, he was your cipher. Yeah, he was my cipher. Not anymore. Let's cut to the chase. You teamed up with a traitor. Ah! Uh... <laughs> you think I was in on it? I've been risking my life out there. I don't need you questioning my loyalty. Don't get overheated. I was just looking for more information on your cipher. You want intel on Owen? He likes sandwiches. We good? <laughs> yeah, we're good. All right, Don't cool the attitude. It's my job to question everything and everyone. You like telling me that. It's true. I do trust you. I hope you can believe that. Sure. I think my freelancer's being a massive douchebag right now. <laughs> There's no need. It is, as she says, her job to question shit. Freelancer. My favorite customer. Thought I'd drop by, say hello. So, I'm surprised you never took up flying a javelin, Prospero. I told you that story about the Titan we followed? Well, after that, I gave the Lancer thing a shot. I bet you were a pretty good one. <laughs> well, yeah. My aim was pretty wicked. It's just... What? Uh, it's hard to be a freelancer from the ground. I'm only telling you this because I like you. But... It freaked me out. I'm afraid of heights. <laughs> so am I. No, sir. You just need to get used to it. Give it some time. You adjust. You can't adjust to hurtling through the air faster than a wyvern ever dreamed, looking down, then realizing the only thing between you and the ground is nothing. Don't look down, then. Too late. By that point, you slammed into a cliff and smeared bits of yourself all over the place. Best not to overthink it. Oh, I had plenty of thoughts at the time. Most of them involving language I shouldn't repeat. But the one that mattered was this. If I couldn't fly, I had to help those who do. What'd you decide? I'd seen that Titan. I knew what this world could throw at us. So, I decided to throw it right back. Deliver some of our own fearful awe. Prospero style. Yeah, man. If it helps us win, gives us a mental edge in a fight, I'm all for it. Maybe it's made a difference. I hope so. It's all we can do in this world. Her own little thing. Fort Tarsus needs more people like you. Careful now. Don't go giving the competition any ideas. Mum's the word. See you later, Prospero. Till next time. What's the, uh, what's the thing in the shop this week, then? Airboxing or the Dreadnought armor pack from week one. Brilliant. You're already reusing your skin sets. Good stuff. Okay, that's not the button I was looking for. That's everyone here. That's everyone there, right? So uh, let's just go forward and work around. We can do Halleck last. I wonder when I unlock my next javelin, actually. Can't be too far away. I feel like we unlocked Interceptor quite a while ago. Sup, woman? Wait. You're not the one to talk to? Oh, it's her. Okay. First you find the tomb of General Tarsus, now the Fortress of Dawn. Oh. I'm not saying it's like the world's telling you that you were really meant Goodbye, Bren. It's him. They re You're just the freelancer I've been waiting for. Thanks, Pernal. How's the petition going? Quite well. I have high hopes we'll be seeing improved safety policy in the near future. But we should discuss another matter that may impact you as a freelancer. All right. I wouldn't be so casual. If we don't deal with this, someone is going to die. Oh, boy. Really? You sure you're not overestimating the danger? Not at all. If you allow me to outline the situation, I'm sure you'll agree with my assessment. I'm waiting. The Javelin launch deck has no safety rail. 
<laughs> Good one, Berndel. I thought you were serious. I'm not joking. The deck is extremely dangerous for maintenance workers. Arlick Janky slipped off the edge during his morning cleaning shift. Is he okay? He broke both legs, one index finger, three ribs, and his nose. He's okay now, but he's still walking a little funny. And he makes a whistling sound when he breathes. Uh, <laughs> okay, maybe then. I'm sorry to hear that. Is there anything I can do? Yes. Support my proposal to install safety railings on the launch deck. But javelins might catch on the railings when they launch. That's a good point. Hmm. I've got it. Tethered safety harnesses. Thanks for helping me come up with a solution. You're welcome. I only wish the rest of this fort shared your concern for safety. Yeah, that would be nice, eh? Right. Onwards. Lucky Jack, Faye, and then Halleck. Man, I wish that hold wide start expedition thing faded away. Right, yes, I understand. I can do that if I want to. I don't. Hey, how are things here? We've got freelancers going in and out, work getting done. I've got reports and charts flying all over. Never dull. How about you? You holding up? Ah! Uh, <laughs> I've had some tough missions lately. Look, what happened with Owen, it's rough. I won't say otherwise. We all hit our lows, right? I've never seen you less than positive. Hey, I'm as human as anyone. We've all had that job that should have been different. What's yours? Uh, you want sad story corner? All right. That's my favorite kind of corner. Mission a few years back. I was supposed to go too. I did something stupid, got injured before heading out. Someone took my place. They lost a cipher. Maybe their life. That doesn't compare to you, but... You felt guilty? Yeah. Everyone else called me lucky. Uh, you can't blame yourself. It wasn't your fault. I know that now. What I'm trying to say, badly, is a lot gets thrown at you. Whatever happens, we know what you've done for the Enclave. Faye's got your back. So do the rest of us. Thanks, Jack. I'll see you around. I, I like him. It. Good man. Hello. <laughs> you got anything to say? You've sort of replaced Owen over here. Faye, how's it going? Thank goodness you're here. I've been arguing with an Antium cipher for what seems like all of time. Is there some kind of trouble in the capital? Not unless a rash of bad taste counts. They think the Crimson Lancer is a better series than Dawn Guard. Radio shows. <laughs> Those fights must be brutal. Honor is at stake. So. You're a Dawn Guard fan? It's objectively better. Crimson Lancer is a lot of Mylan's propaganda. Don't tell Halleck I said that. Uh, sure. He won't find out from me, even on pain of death. Thanks. You wouldn't believe how emotional he gets over that show. When they killed off his favorite character, he moped about it for weeks. Hey, don't give away anything. I'm not current on either one. Really? You should catch up. On Dawnguard, at least. I have all the tapes sent from Antium. Every episode that's been broadcast for the last seven years. Oh, you can boy. skip the first season. The Curse of Stone Tide episode in season two is really where things start. No. This is a side of you I didn't know existed. Disagree. Nobody can spend every second of every day working. Sure, but your hobby is listening to radio shows about other people doing our jobs. All right, then. What do you do for fun? Uh... Can't tell you. <laughs> um, nothing. Unless you count eating and sleeping. Nobody counts that. And you've succeeded in making me sad. Oh. You know that's not healthy, right? Everybody needs a break now and then. Yeah, um, maybe once the Dominion are out of the picture, I'll learn an instrument or something. Right, just getting sadder. <laughs> Don't worry, I'll come up with something. In regards to what she was saying... You never skip well, season one. Will spend his time a Unless it's an anthology series, like the Fargo TV show, where every series is totally different characters, totally different, you know, stuff going on, different time period. That's fine. You can skip season one then. Or True Detective, where watch season one because it's amazing, skip season two because it's shit, and then watch season three because it's great again. Uh, but in general, 
You never skip season one, even if it's bad. <laughs> Gotta learn the characters, figure out the backstory, the relationships, and then you'll have more of an idea what's going on when you do head into We're really gonna build our own the good stuff. Dawn? You think we can pull this off? What I say about looking too far ahead, focus on the here and now. Right now, we need materials and information. That means we need connections. Corvus gave me this job. Can't they help us out? When was the last time government agency got anything done fast? Point taken. So, connections. Who do we need? Arcanists are the obvious one. Weird and impossible are their specialties. Okay. I already have an Arcanist contact. Matthias Sumner. I'll see what he can do for us. Good. Next is the Sentinels. They've got javelins, parts, and contacts in Antium. Fortunately, there's a Sentinel Dax who's been looking for you. She's supposed to be a bigwig of some sort. Might be just what we need. Huh. What's an important Sentinel want with me? Worth finding out, right? Meanwhile, there's plenty of other stuff you can find for the shield. What do we need? We need materials. And they're not easy to get. Faye gave me a list. We need some kind of metal that's only found inside the heart of a titan. No! You have to hunt down a titan? Well, you're kidding. That's the not easy part. Scars are always scavenging around Shaper ruins. They might have found our metal too. Your run-of-the-mill Scar won't have a titan heart stashed away. A Scar I might. Maybe Luminary, if you can find one. I don't know if that's worse than titan hunting, really. Nothing Great. is worse so, uh, than titan hunting, Halleck. Hunt titan or just ask a Luminary very politely for it. No problem. Hey. We got this. Just do one thing at a time, yeah? Yeah, right. Faye has a plan to recreate the Dawn Shield from the Javelin of General Tarsis. Halleck is convinced he can build it, but he needs materials. Lots of them. To collect them, defeat Iskari, maybe hunt a few Titans. A few Titans? No. <laughs> Check with Matthias and watch for a new contact lady, Adaxia Dell. The more I dig, the more I'm certain that gen the General's Javelin is the key. At the Satomi in Fortuo, I found a mouldy version... Shouldn't Moldy have a U in it? A Moldy version of the volume of Tarsus with scribbled notes in the margins. Something about a shield that kept her steady and repelled Fulminus Great Breath. Fulmi Fulminus's Great Breath. Exciting. If we find her javelin, I may figure out what that means. Corium. When a titan dies, the liquid pumping through its stone heart cools and hardens to become Corium, one of the strongest metals in the world. And we haven't been harvesting this from the two titans we've already defeated? Recently? Seems like a strange, uh, <laughs> strange choice. Oh, I can talk to you again. And Matthias and these guys. Mysterious beginnings. Crafting the Dawn Shield. Triple threat. Crafting the Dawn Shield. Okay, there's a few people to chat to, but apparently you are number one. Yet? The tomb of General Tarsus, making our own Javelin of Dawn. You and Faye are a good team. See what you miss when you leave the family? I'm betting it was more Faye than you. The brains, maybe, but someone had to keep the Strider going. Defend us in the wilds. Does that mean you're still flying a Javelin? Well, as soon as I get my suit in shape. Just needs a little more work. Oh, so... Can't rush these things. What, do you think General Tarsus charged into battle without checking her equipment? Good point. Thought maybe your leg was acting up. That? This agreement with a giant antisorm over who was dinner. He snapped my knee. I boiled him with butter. This an inspection? Hmm. <laughs> just concerned, man. Believe it or not, I just wanted to make sure you're okay. Now you sound like Faye. I'll tell you what I told her. Old Halleck has some dings. But I'm a freelancer to my grave. Legion of okay, Dawn well, Corps. let's you not get to the grave anytime soon. General Tarsus could fight a chimera for three days on a mountaintop in a lightning storm. I can manage a creaky knee. Later, Halleck. I feel like people are, must be exaggerating shit that Tarsus has done. <laughs> get Corian by assisting Matthias or Dax. Wait, it's an it's an either or. Oh, Dax is I remember Dax actually. Dax is the Ponzi one. Well, if it's an either or thing, then I'll go with Matthias. I'd like to see what they both have to say, so hopefully I can go to Dax after. But just in case, we'll uh, we'll start here. What have you been up to? You'll love it. Okay, it's called the Manifold. Well, 
Technically, I call it the Manifold. And it does what, exactly? For years, I had heard of a type of Shaper Relic that was able to amplify and augment the qualities of other objects. Never encountered one, never knew anyone that had, but... Thanks to the Elysian Manuscript, I think I know where one is. Right here. In Bastion. And you think it'll amplify and augment the power of my javelin? Precisely. Excited yet? Uh, Absolutely creamy. Don't worry. Once we find the manifold and get it working, you will be. Guaranteed. First, the manifold. Then, we boost your javelin. You silence the heart of rage, and boom. Everyone lives happily ever after. It's a little more complicated than that. Ah, details. I've sent all the particulars of the location to Faye. I can't wait. Okay. Go back to Faye. Heard Tassin mumbling about the Dominion? Did you know I once hid in a mound of water? I did. You've told me that before. Right. Is it seriously telling me... Wait. Why is there a little box around here now? Or is Faye just like hanging outside or something? Hmm. Is it just telling me to go back? What? Hmm. Okay. Let's... Hang on. Is there anything else I can talk to him about? Because there's still a thing in here, right? There's still a... An icon telling me to come here? So many stories. Was she as fierce as they say? Did you get to experience the splendor of her banquet table? Ah, uh, yeah. Something like that. Super. Hmm. Do you have something else to say? No? Okay, I don't know then. Um, let's go see what Dax says then. We will, if it is, we'll do Matthias' stuff first. Oh, sneeze. And then see so if it still wants us to... you know Sentinel-2 in Season 1 of Dawnguard, right? Yeah. <laughs> Would you care to hear me reenact my death scene from the second last episode of Season 1? Okay. Okay, so at the critical moment, the gate was being swarmed by scorpions. Now you shout, Look out, Sentinel! Look out, Sentinel! <laughs> No! <coughs> Nailed it. That was it, huh? <sighs> oh, and when you hear it with the sound effects, it's it's much more affecting. <laughs> I'm sure it is. Can I get another drink? Oh, hello. Uh, interesting camera. The freelancer that survived the heart of rage. Oh wait, I no. You'd be... What? I thought you'd be bigger. I thought Dax hey, was the dude in the corner. Hey, one sec. Go! I was three steps away, Carney. You had no chance. I got this. Everything's fine. Hey. We can do this later. My aunt disappeared in the jungle. I'm sorry to hear that. I don't find missing people. It was ten years ago. She's dead now. I don't find missing corpses either. That's not what I'm after. Ever heard of the Emerald Abyss? A jungle region where dozens of people have vanished. Including my aunt, a royal cartographer. Gone without a trace. A royal cartographer? Not just any, the best. <sighs> Beautiful. My aunt left a journal. She was onto something big. No. Like <laughs> has it, the first time anyone vanished in the Emerald Abyss was the same day the Heart of Rage appeared. That's why I'm here. Right. That time you went into the heart? Yeah, an entire merchant caravan was never heard from again. My lady. My aunt's journal proves there is a connection between the Heart of Rage and the Emerald Abyss. One of the world's biggest mysteries just waiting for us to solve. So, you in? Sure. I need to see that journal. Sentinel deck. Damn it. Don't go anywhere. Why? Commander. What is going on here? Keeping the streets safe, sir. 
Notice this undesirable entering the premises. Stole that citizen's bag. That is not your job. You file reports at your desk. You... It's no matter. Your family has ordered you home. To Antium? Immediately. Beautiful. Come with me. Now. I'll contact your cipher. We'll set up a meet. Explain everything, okay? Man, the frame rate just dies goes. whenever that woman at the bar goes in front of the, the camera. Of Antium. A glorious sight. What? You mean Dax? Of course. Lady Adaxia is the most eligible unmarried woman in the world. She will be mine. <laughs> no, she won't. Take a hint, dickhead. Okay. Didn't, did you want to talk to me as well, then? Red no, guess not. It was just her. Okay. So... Oh, wait, hang on. Lord Roy. Hello, Lord Roy. Oh, it's you. If Dax is third Lord Sleaze. What's she doing with the Sentinels? I abhor gossip, but her family forced her to join. Something about learning discipline? Uh, both of these responses are kind of shitty. But this is less shitty than the other one, I guess. Good training for a future empress. Yes, well, she could be a little more diligent in her lessons. But all the more reason she'll need someone reliable at her side. And you're volunteering. I made the journey in person to show commitment. I hope she appreciates my sacrifice. Doubtful. More likely she'll punch you in the face. Uh, excuse me? That's what I would do if I was her. <laughs> well, I never. This conversation is over. Good day to you. Savage. Okay, anyone else? <laughs> I mean, I'm sure it said speak to Faye about something, but she ain't there, so. Or rather, she's not got the conversation thing above her head, so maybe not. I guess we could just pass by on the way back. How'd it go with Sentinel Dax? You could have told me I was meeting royalty. <laughs> Where's the fun in that? Dax gave us a location outside the walls. Meet her there when you're ready. Or I could do Matthias's thing. Uh, do you want to talk? Is it just not showing? No, I guess not. Okay. Uh, all right, we can launch from here. <laughs> uh, mysterious beginnings. No, I want to do Matthias's thing. Oh wait, what's that? Public. A cry for help. Who's that from? I don't even remember that. Triple threat. Okay. Let's do that first. Sure. Sure thing. Because I don't know if side missions ever, like, become not available later on. So. Do them while we can. Get them while they're hot. Zoom, zoom. Yeah, I'm not. I'm really not sure if it's saying we have to do both of those missions, or whether one will cancel out the other one. But uh, Matthias is my boy, and uh, <laughs> never even met Dax before. I don't think had I. I don't think so. So yeah, your boy's got loyalty. Bros to the close. Loyalty is important. As are shorter loading times. And we're going to have to fight another Titan. Uh, no. No. Fighting Titans makes me want to cry. Cry. As do these loading times. My goodness, this is a big one, though. I don't remember them normally taking this long. Normally, by the time I've complained about it, like, twice, then it finishes. But we're on to, like, three or four times now. Holy shit. 
fifth complaint is going to be imminent. And uh, then I'm going to get mad. Okay, no. Finally. This rain will make them harder to fight. 